Hi guys, my name is Dimitri Marmonides, owner of Epic Ice, and today's video is gonna be the part two of the how to rescue someone in distress with his kite and board, okay? So on the uh, part one video on how to do that, I show you how to communicate with the person uh, in case you see hey, he needs some help and he's with his guy, he's holding it, he's in the water and he needs to get back to shore. So first of all was to communicate with the person and then to let him know that you're gonna take uh, his kite first to back to the beach, okay? Hey, just that's not boring. People need to know about that, okay? So anyway, uh, so, uh, you know, on part one, it showed you how to uh, grab the kite, make sure that the kite is totally detached, the kite is totally detached thing, so you don't rip your shoulder when you drag the kite. And uh, part one showed you how you drag the kite back to the beach. Okay, so now part two is once you have the kite uh, secured on the beach, you come back and you have to take the rider and his board back to the beach also okay but you have to let him know first before you take everything away okay so you have a few options but the best option the easiest one will be to um, uh, let him know that uh, actually the easiest one will be to uh, uh, grab the rider and the board together so you don't have to go back and forth okay but then in in order to do that the rider needs to be a good kiter and needs to uh, know how to uh, to hold to yourself because what he's gonna do is uh, if you're gonna do this option you're gonna use the rider and the board together then the rider you need to let him know what you're gonna do so the rider is gonna have to grab to your harness behind and then have his board on his feet and it's gonna be tandem so both of you will be kiting okay so this is a little bit hard and tricky so the kiter needs to uh, to know how to do that okay uh, that's one way and the other way which is easier okay but it has more back and forth is just to take uh, the board back to the beach come back take the rider and drag him behind okay same thing it grabs to your um, harness but then this time it gets dragged all the way to the beach okay so it puts a lot of pressure on you a lot of pressure on the lines and kite but at least you're taking back home safe okay uh, now the easiest way to hold to carry a board is you don't want to carry the board with you you don't want to take the board and put on you and try to hold it one hand all that because with the wind sometimes it can just turn around and come and smack in your face so it's very dangerous you want to keep the board away from your body away from the bar away from everything in case something happens so what you do is the easiest way if you want to drag the board to the beach or bra drag it back to the kiter what you have to do is <clears throat> take the board but then face the board to the direction you're gonna go. The board has to be a little bit a point of view. Then grab the foot strap or put your hand inside the foot strap and then dive the kite and then keep the board on the water while your hand is holding and directing the board. That's the easiest. You can even sit on the board while you're kiting on your board. Just sit, bring the board and sit on it. And then there you go. Then you have two hands, okay? But the good thing is you need to have a stopper ball on the bar who will be so easy much easier because with one hand you can control the entire thing while the other hand is holding the board or the kite so make sure when you go and save someone a stoppable on your bar is really really nice to have because you can control the kite in one hand while the kite has full power okay so hopefully this video will help and hopefully i'll see you in the water